we just come out oh, of the game, man. literally just come out of the game, absolutely budgeting. I bumped into my mates and the boys. How are you feeling looking at that? And we've been absolutely magnificent today. Man, absolutely brilliant. You know what? We we had we had no leagues on the podcast. We did. And he was the last player to score a winning goal there. 40, 41 years ago. You know, you just sensed it, you know, they had a bit of a period, but oh, we were on the front foot from the start. Totally carnage, that was first half. We were dominant, totally dominant. Totally dominant. And to be honest, how we did it How we did it go. Thank you very much. Back to you for Man United fans, saying the best night on the best back to you. And the thing is, you know, that the goal as well, the weight went in and the clearance of Martinho and oh. Oh, and then right at the end you've got the drama. Do you want to be in it? No, mate, we've recorded. Yeah, yeah, carry on. Thank you, though. Well done, guys. You deserve it. Anyway. Cheers, man. Cheers, shit. Man, you know, just come inside with a bit of cheese. Hey, get that. You know. <laughs> Talk to them, who cares about it? And it's, see, we have Class United fans and bitter, but never mind. Yeah, Jeevan, how are you feeling about it? From minute one, that's the fastest I've seen us play in terms of our pace. Just from minute one, 100 miles an hour, spraying passes, one, two touch. And the performance today, we played them at the park. I don't care what anyone says. Absolutely. I we played them Absolutely. From minute one to minute These 19. kids have watched Wolves beat Man United. I know. In the league. And what about yourself? I think the brakes helped us a bit there because we just gelled together and it's the best I've seen us play. And it was, to be honest, you know Trinko? Everyone's yeah. like, oh, Trinko. That was a massive stroke. The three of them just passed, kept, passed, and they were just a nuisance. You saw the centre-halves. They didn't have a clue. They were like, who do we pick up? Where's Pedence? Where's Trinko? And the only thing missing, obviously, was the goals. And we thought at half-time, oh, come on. Yeah, on. that's it. Are we going to score? Is it, never, be like, is it like the first game? A, a derby oh, count. Hey, what we were saying exactly that. It was exactly like almost a derby rep. Yeah. Get apart from hey, I tell you what. I tell you what. What about that save? You know when Ronaldo's lining up that free kick, even though yeah. he didn't take it, and then Jose Sarr has done what he's done all season. He's been absolute quality. I mean, I think was it Neville that said he's been oh. uh, signing the signing the season. Signing season. Um, what about your um, your performance rate and your man of the match? I'm gonna, you've got to give this performance a nine. A nine? Yeah. Um, and your man of the match? Man of the match. I'm going to give it to. Ooh. I thought Pedence did really well. I thought he caused that back for some problems today. He was good, one eh? About yourself, man of the match? I'm going to go with Martinho. Oh, he he yeah. scored the winning goal and then throughout the game. He was, I don't think he lost he the was ball. hungry for it today. Oh, they all were, though, to be yeah, fair. I mean, it, it needs everybody to play well, but Pedence just had something about him he wanted to kick the ball he wanted the ball he just even when he lost it it didn't matter you just gave it back to him gave it back to him and he just caused um on a um in our cars all right have you yeah yeah. i just heard the people shouting things to you so yeah just for if you're on call just go and get no 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 no, no, thank you very much just ignore everyone yeah yeah, appreciate it so pedence like uh, he was for me he set the tone set the tone and everybody just played brilliantly but you know it's just People say performance rating. 40 years, 40 years or something? 41 years. 41 years. If you can't get 10 out of 10 after a win at Old Trafford after 40 years, we'll never get one. So that's a 10 performance, man. We've come here. We've Everyone's a little bit down. Are we buying anyone? Have we got strength in depth? But they're producing absolute miracles. But I, I'll tell you what, I was thinking today it could go one or two ways. Not playing for two weeks with all the COVID and are they going to have the energy? Yeah. We could get, but it, they were absolutely hungry for it. The energy levels were through the roof. I'm with you. I've never given a 10 out of 10 performance um, in all the times I've been doing this. But I just don't think for a complete performance like it was today, and we dominated. And if we'd have won by three and four, I don't think they could you know, have argued. You yeah, know, Ronaldo, Cavani, Rashford, Greenwood, Fernand, they tried Sanchez. And, 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 and to be honest, I thought at back three. We're never troubled at any time. They had that. They had about ten minutes in the second half where they had an offside goal and won at the bar. That was the only little. Yeah, little just after uh, yeah. Bruno, Bruno Fernandez. Yeah, came just on. a little. Would you expect at a place like this? But we held firm. Saar was magnificent. Claimed every ball. Came out. He's like a, he is like a, another defender. Oh, he's, he he's, he's world class. The way the way he plays. So I'm gonna I'm gonna go with Daniel Pedence as well. Yeah. I thought he was absolutely yeah. magnificent today. He was everywhere. The whole team were fantastic. Samedo, brilliant. The wing backs did a good job as well. The defence, like you said, was solid. The midfield, you know, Trinko is probably his best game. But Daniel... Do you know what? The strength in depth is lacking. We know that, and we know we don't score enough goals. But literally every player 
bar one or two have improved from last season. Keeper, defenders, Patino, Neves, they have improved. It's the forward areas where we've been lacking, where you, people what, are a little bit, you know. What, Fabio came on, he did well as well. Fabio was brilliant. Quite. Fabio, Winning absolutely. Free kicks. Him coming on rattled the defence, and that's why we scored. <laughs> Just after he came on. So, <laughs> you know. You've got to give Troy credit for the goal as well. Yeah, I mean, he did. I mean, it, 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 you know, he first first attack he came on he yeah. beat himself didn't he? but he kept going and he, he will cause problems what's going to happen with Triory in the window we don't know will he sign a new contract will he go we don't know but the thing is you know let's let's enjoy the moment enjoy it, following yeah. Wolves you know we've had bad days good days and, and actually coming back to you know win here and the way we play and the way we defend it just enjoy these tight days and times go next game and do it again, like you know what I mean. That's why we've got to follow it up as well. Um, so it's finished here, one nil to the Wanderers. Uh, what a start to the to 2022. Is it going to be a magical unbeaten. year for Wolves? Unbeaten. We are unbeaten. 100% record. 100% record, record after one game. Uh, <laughs> smash a like to the video, leave your comments below. The match vlog will be up later, extra time tomorrow night. Absolutely brilliant. I've managed to catch hold of these guys as well to celebrate the moment. Always Wolves. And we're never going to forget this day. And hopefully it'll be the catalyst for the rest of the season. Absolutely Brilliant. magnificent. Let's go. Oh.